Yes, good morning everyone. Again, this is Tibisian Amilita Clemenia. And I just want to remind you guys from our previous blog that there will be zero benefits for inactive members going forward. So those who haven't paid their program fee, even this month of January, those are the inactive members of TBC. Okay, so we'll just read this um, last blog of admin dated January 2. Okay, so Let's make this simple to clear up con confusion. Money has to come from somewhere, somewhere. So let's reason this out. TBC fees have always been paid in crypto. Currently, that crypto is KLAV. KLAV has a price. When the KLAV price is going up, we are pumping money out of the two trillion dollar crypto market into our KLAV liquidity but when the KLAV price is going down we are draining money out of the KLAV liquidity and that money goes into the two trillion dollar crypto market this is a very basic understanding about liquidity if the price is going sideways, sideways, it means our collective payments of program fees are balanced against the market selling KLAV day-to-day. So using the approach of allocating 25% of total revenue is the safest way to protect the KLAV price from falling quickly. We don't want to go out of business in a month or two, do we? Remember that 50% of total revenue is paid out immediately in bounties to the sponsors. Have you been watching the admin soak up the supply of KLAV coins over the last 6 months? That means the admin wasn't collecting every dollar that came in from the payments of program fees. Just in December alone, $39,000 was paid out in the guarantees of 39 members that work the hardest at building up the size of our community. On top of the 50 winners of the contest, which were paid out a total of $12,750 plus well all over $100,000 was paid out to programmers, support team, and computer internet networks in December, the bills. At the beginning of December, we had 27,000 active members, and at the end of December, we have 52,917 active members. We almost doubled in a month, in one month. Plus, we can't forget that over $10,000 was paid out in goodwill for the needy in the Philippines. Shout out Philippines. Alright. So don't let those that can't do math tell how. Tell you how money works. Or how the admin is keeping all the money to himself. The answer to getting paid more from the match offer is growth. The more we grow the more each team will be able to collect. Wow. That's it. The match offer is a straightforward growth incentive. The dam will quit and we lost everything. And the smart can do the math and no admin has been more than fair. And that the match offer is a strong incentive to grow even faster than before all right so that's it guys um I, I don't know what to say or what would be the output this coming january 12 is the rebranding of tbc and um we'll see the the inactive 
members if they they are still on the um on the system okay so see you in the next vlog vlog guys and have a blessed day bye for now